Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Lumix DMC LX100. It's a Panasonic camera. Panasonic is the maker of Lumix. And uh, I was actually looking for a camera that is not overly expensive and can actually create the kind of content I want. That means it shoots 4K, it shoots and it shoots at a higher frame rate. So I actually got my hands on the Lumix LX100 and I'm going to be doing a comprehensive review today. So let's go to specs. I'm going to put most of the specs that, uh, most of all the major specs, I'm going to put everything on the screen. So currently, the major, the, the specs I'm actually very concerned about is, it shoots 4K, the camera shoots 4K at 30 frames per second and 24 frames per second, and it also shoots 60 frames per second at HD, that's 1080p. The camera is 60 megapixels, so it has a 4.3 crop micro third sensor. It shoots raw, which is actually good for video exporting. It also has a Wi-Fi and NFC, which you can use to share your photos and pictures as soon as possible. So let's, I think let's just go straight into the unboxing of the camera. So I'm going to be doing this unboxing with one hand. It's going to be a one-handed unboxing because I'm holding my mobile phone on one hand and I'm going to be doing the unboxing with the other hand. So, as you can see, Russell is Lumix. So, out of the box, there's the manual. Nobody reads this anyway. So, eh? Oh, this is going to be hard. So this is the camera. Yeah. Drop. So this is what the camera actually looks like out of the box. I don't know if you can see all the stuff on the back. Yes. I right, so all the camera functions. So after removing the camera, the other things contained in the box include the, uh, let me see. I think this is, okay, this is the charger, this is the charging port for the battery. Um, this is cable. I don't know what this is, it looks like. Oh, okay. So I think this is flash. It actually has an external flash, which is pretty interesting. I'd like to see how this works out. Battery. Cable. That's all that's in the box. I don't know how much charge it has on it, but let's just let's just put it in and see what happens in it inside. This case goes in here, under. Let's put it in. Uh, but I think there's supposed to be a memory card here. There's meant to be a memory card here, but there's currently no memory card now. But let's just see how. So where is the switch? Okay, this is the switch. This is where you put it on. So that's lens cover. Let's move the lens cover. Switch it on. 
Nice. This is what you're going to do. It's like. Hello. So let me just move the camera to the front so that you guys can actually see what I'm saying. Okay. So. This is what the camera looks like out of the box. I think it has a... Let me make sure I can see there. I think this is the button for recording. Button for recording, button for AF lock. One thing you notice out of the box for this camera is it's actually pretty small. I think this is the lens. It's actually pretty small for a camera. So you, you can actually use it and take it out around. Uh, there's a viewfinder here. So this is actually pretty difficult for me because I'm just using one hand. So well I guess the next review that I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get the proper stand. So out of the box without testing any of the functions yet. Currently I can test, I can't take, I can't make any video yet till I actually get the memory card that can actually record um, everything on it because most cameras when they come, they come without the memory card. Without going any testing in my review on it, first of all, it's a portable camera and it's not overly expensive. It may be on the high side for some people, but it's not overly expensive. So it can be used as a vlogging camera. It can be used as a, as a very quick camera to just capture moments since it's very portable, so you can always take it anywhere, you can fit into your pocket. So it's not, it's not as big as other DSLR cameras. If you want to be serious about vlogging and all, you can actually get this camera, it's actually good. So, see you guys next time on my channel. If this is your first time, subscribe and like my video. If you like my videos, I post a lot of content regularly. So, see you guys next time. Next video will be the camera and me using it to capture moments. Bye-bye, see ya. Oh, 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 oh,